Hi, Rosanna. I know you don't know me, but I've gone to school with you the past 11 years, and... I know exactly who you are, Calvin. I think you're so hot. Really? Your eyes pierce me from behind those thick lenses. I don't believe this. Your lips are so smooth and moist. Lip balm. But most of all, the right in between, I love your sexy little... Of all the organs to be well endowed, look at it. First thing I see every morning. First thing anyone sees when they look at me. On the first day of my last year of high school, I know I should be thinking about AP tests and colleges, but this just feels a lot more important. How can I expect Rosanna, the prettiest girl in school, to want me, or even notice me when God parked Mount Everest in the center of my face? My only hope is to make a lot of money and get a job, a nose job. I've been saving up for one since I was 10, and I keep the facial circumcision fund right here in Mr. Potato Head. Actually, in his butt. That's where you're supposed to keep all his extra body parts, but I threw all those away except the... I hate that word. The fund is up to 537 bucks. Barely enough to sculpt one nostril. My parents say I, sh I should just be less insecure, but when you're 17, and it's potentially the one thing keeping you from her, a giant schnoz is a pretty big deal. Less insecure, that's what they say. But I'm in high school, and let's face it, every day is judgment day, so what's my fate? I'll have to wait. And holy crap, it's almost 7.58. I can't be late on my first day of school. You know, other kids are so lucky, they don't have to deal with things like this. I hate my ass, it is my jinx. It must be made of polyester, cause it never ever shrinks. The fattest ass in my whole class. And all these diet milkshakes do is give me gas. Look at a lady gaga's butt. Is that a perfect butt or what? Soon it will be Christmas. I've been good and kind. Santa, my you grant a tie behind. Security meltdown. But a name. Look how Calvin jokes around and Brett says things that sound profound. Me, I'm just the it girl. Boys like what they see. But could it be all there is to me?
support homeless babies. New club after school today. Come support homeless babies. Did you talk to me? You're Calvin, right? You know my name? You're like the smartest kid in school. I'm Rosanna. Like, I don't know her name. I know her bra size. I'm starting a new club to raise money for charity, and our first meeting is today after school. You should come. We're picking a slogan so we could really use someone clever like you. I'd love to help you. So you'll come? But I've wrestling practice. Crap. When's the next one? Here's a flyer. Shit tots? Shy tots. Mm. Students helping innocent toddlers off the streets. Hey, is that your student ID? No. It's... I like it. It's interesting. Thanks. I believe that's how they describe the elephant man. <laughs> You're so funny. Actually, it reminds me of a movie star. Really? I think his name is Adrian Brody. Sup, Calvinator? Good and you? Hey, I like your shirt. Where'd you get it? Oh, yeah. You can have mine. Then you won't have one. Well, if you got one, then I, I wouldn't wear it anyway, so it's like the same thing. <laughs> you have calculus, right? I'll walk with you. Nice talking to you. <laughs> Did you hear the new morning announcements, girl? Her voice sounds like Elmo. <laughs> she did sound like Elmo. Elmo, pleasure to fly. That's a horrible impression. And what was that thing about homeless babies? I'm sorry, but who would go to that? I think it sounds pretty cool. Yeah, but you think, like, lunchboxes are cool. So. Lunchboxes are cool, I'm telling you. They're not, Calvin. They're, not. They're like peace in a pot. Please tell me, God, is there a I've been through the rest of the vegetable medley And boys are all so superficial, it's deadly Will this year be the year My true love will appear I can see him now Handing me a love note in the hall I can see him now Choosing me over watching basketball I can see him now Showing up at my door Cause he had to see my face Understanding when I want to stop at second base I can see him now Ready for our nightly rendezvous What's that on his arm? It's my name Written in a fake tattoo I can see us now Sharing drinks, holding hands, rubbing noses in the car Trying hard not to scream from how similar we are He's my special guy God, I wish that I could see him now I'm the new kid once again Seven different schools since I was ten Wouldn't mind if someone took the time to say Hello! This place is as friendly as death row But it's nothing new It's deja vu Hey, do you, need, do you know where room 214 is? Me? Whoa. Well, <laughs> uh, I, I'm lost myself. Are you new here also? No, but my sense of direction is like infantile. Yeah, my, my dad sells tile. <laughs> so, you just moved here? Yeah. Well, good luck. Okay, thanks. <laughs> Why'd I say that? Why'd he say that? She's hot. He's cute. <laughs> I can see it now. Like an instant message from above. Like a kid in town. And then. Like a prophecy of love. I can tell him now. I can show you the ropes.
you've never seen Pee-wee's Big Adventure, so you can't judge. Next movie night, you'll see. It's a neglected masterpiece. Calvin, masterpiece means like Pulp Fiction or Kill Bill, not freaking Edward Scissorhands. Hey, look, Rosanna has study hall, too. Okay, you were saying? Tim Burton and Tarantino were equally brilliant, but since their movies are so different, you can't really compare them. It's like Night and Oranges. Like what? What? Some people say like Night and Day, and some people say like Apples and Oranges. So I say like Night and Oranges. It's more extreme that way. How about like Calvin and Normal? That's even more extreme. Did you know she's starting a charity? That's wonderful. So I haven't seen you since your campy trip. We should hang out Saturday night. Movie and a little catch-up? A little catch-up. I would relish the opportunity. <sighs> and, and since I mustered the courage to ask... Oh my god, she's coming over here. Why is she... Oh, never mind. Oh, oh my god, why are you so obsessed with her? What are you talking about? I'm not obsessed with her. <laughs> oh. What? Don't you think it's a little bit odd how you're so... Maybe a tiny crush. Turn around. Oh, uh, hi. Oh my gosh. Hi. You look happy. Just thinking about someone, that's all. Someone special. Someone you want to get funky with? Shut up, Brett. Someone I want to get to know better. Yeah. Calvin, what are you doing later? Back to school shopping with nothing. Why? And you're on the wrestling team, right? They were desperate. Yeah, I'm done at six. Can you meet me at the Hollywood Diner around seven? Oh, great. Great. Right? There's a Shy Tots meeting after school today. It's a new club to help homeless babies. Haircut. Haircut, sorry. Oh, I wrote some ideas for your slogan. Oh. Wow, there's like hundreds of them. It's such a good cause. <laughs> You're an incredible person. I'll present these at the meeting later. Goodbye. <laughs> I'll see you tonight. <laughs> I'll see you tonight. Did, did Rosanna just ask me... I mean, you don't think. You don't think. You don't think. That she's horny as hell, and she's meaning to tell you she wants you. No. When a girl asks a guy to hang out, what could that be about? You tell me. Oh my god, I gotta go. Where are you going? To figure out what the hell I'm gonna say. <laughs> tell her about your tiny crush. Tiny crush? That's what you said. Dumbass. <sighs> Stationary. It's more personal that way. <laughs> so, uh, how was your meeting? It went great. Everyone loved your slogans. Especially me. Really? We decided to use, Baby, it's cold outside. That's a good one. 
And for a fundraiser, we're organizing a bachelor auction. Awesome. What's that? <laughs> we're auctioning off dates with guys in the school. Oh, cool. I've seen those on TV. Yeah. So it seemed like you wanted to talk to me about something? Yes. So, this is going to sound a little forward. I mean, we just talked for the first time today, so I barely know you. I mean, I know you, but I don't know you know you. It's okay. You know how it can be the hardest thing in the world just to let a person know that you like them? I know that exact feeling. I have no idea if this person likes me back. Oh, I think he does. He's just <laughs> waiting for you to say something first. I hope so. He's really special. He's different from everyone else. Yep. He's on the wrestling team. Yep. And he's very handsome. Yep. Really? I think so. Are you okay? You're sweating. Sweating? Uh, maybe the cook opened the oven. You were saying? Do you think you can speak to him for me? The cook? No, Matt. M who's Matt? The guy I'm telling you about. Matt? Yeah, he's new to the school. The new kid? He's not on the wrestling team. He tried out for the coach today when I was in gym. You should see him in his wrestling gear. Oh my god. Oh my god, why are you telling me this? I need someone to talk to him and find out if he likes me. You want me to do that? Guys are more honest with other guys. You seemed really sweet, and you're both on the wrestling team. Will you do it? Sure. Oh my god, thank you! Okay, I gotta go get started on the meeting, okay? Are, aren't we gonna eat? Are you kidding? The food's awful here. <laughs> Okay. So long. I've liked you for so long. It just wasn't meant to happen. It just wasn't meant to be. I'm just not what she is after. Just not her cup of tea I'm just gonna have to move on Just have to let it go It would have been nice just to tell her Even so Look, I know it's not reality I mean, a girl like you guy like me just this once let's bend the rules pretend it's April Fools and want me like I've wanted you it's too good to be true oh it just wasn't meant to happen it just wasn't meant to Try to look for answers Love's not the SAT There won't be a happy ending Can't fight with destiny It just wasn't meant to happen Just wasn't meant to I like your haircut. Uh, my haircut. That's why you missed the meeting yesterday. Yes. Yes, it is. <laughs> well, we could really use someone smart like you to help plan our auction. There's more meetings coming up. Here's the schedule. Okay. Hmm. Okay. Uh, nope. Uh, uh nope. Um, that, that day... My hamster is getting married. Can't do that either. Cat getting married. What? Cat getting married. Yeah, okay. Um. Ooh. Well, just keep it in case your schedule changes, okay? Okay. All right. Yeah. <sighs> So 
So, uh, how long have you been wrestling? Since 3.30, same as you. You, uh, you look pretty good out there. Thanks, you're not too bad too. Yeah, well, I'm hoping to go pro someday. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm Calvin. Matt. So, um, how do you like it here so far? It's okay. Uh, definitely some hot girls. That's always nice. Anyone specific? Actually, there is this one girl I keep seeing. I think her name's Rubella. Y yeah, yeah, that's it. Rubella. She's beautiful. Rosanna? Rosanna, sorry. What'd I say? A virus, but don't worry, she gets it all the time. Really? She seems so healthy. Are you friends with her? Um, a little bit. So, she's a pretty smart girl, huh? Think she likes me? Definitely one or the other. What does that mean? Look, your, your name might have come up. I don't remember. So, what do I do? I don't know. Why don't you ask me for her number? Her phone number? No, her lucky number. Yes, her phone number! No, 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 no. Cause, cause if I get her phone number, I'll, I'll have to call her. And if I call her, I'll have to talk to her. How are you planning to communicate with her? I don't know. I wasn't. You have a girlfriend? No. Boyfriend? No, 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 no. It's something else. I think they call it performance anxiety. There are pills you can take for that, you know. Really? Sure, but if your erection lasts more than no, 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 no. That's not my problem. My problem is talking. You talk fine, more or less. I'm talking fine now, yeah, but it's only because. Because why? Because. Because I don't find you attractive. No offense. Whoa, not checking. But if I did, my words would not be making sense. So hard to imagine. With only guys around me, I always talk real good But when I'm talking to a babe, things don't go as they should I start a conversation, the blood starts rushing south And yada yada, foot is in my mouth But a guy with your looks doesn't mean to be articulate Dude, when there's a hot girl around, I can't even say articulate I screw up all the grammar, I switch the words around I burp a lot and stammer, and I make this wheezing sound <sighs> Soon my tongue stops working, and no more words will come And at that point I stand there looking dumb But that's okay, cause you're the man I'm not I'll tell you why Why? A girl cannot resist a handsome looking guy She will say she needs a man who has a high IQ Then she'll settle for a moron if he looks like you With muscles and a tan But he face it for the man That's easy for you to say You don't have a talking problem. No. But don't you think your problems could be worse? How? Imagine if you had them in reverse. Reverse. What? Check it out. The thing that I am best at is having lots to say. But when you look like me, the girls don't listen anyway. So I can be poetic and clever without end. And still they'll only want me as a friend Dude, don't be modest, you're the man I'm serious That's what I've heard Nope Cause all the kids here say you're smart but not a nerd And if you can give a girl a little food for thought She will see you as good looking even if you're not Thanks. So tell yourself you can I can't You've got wit so you're the man Well, thank you, but my wit is useless trap beneath this face Unless... What? Nothing. Okay. Unless... What? If you were my mouthpiece, I'm sure I could win her over. For you. Yeah. A guy with your looks and my words, she won't know what hit her. But what doctor could do that type of operation? <laughs> what? Not a brain transplant. Listen. Step one, I write a note for you Step to give her. Step one, you write a note for me to Step give two, her. Step two, you ask her out for Saturday night. Step two, I ask her out for Saturday night. Step three, night. I write the lines that you'll Step deliver. Step you write the lines that I'll Step deliver. Step four, I'll teach you how to say them right. I'll say them right. 
Step five, you ask her out to Johnny Step Rockets. Step five, where? It's good. And say all my romantic lines and by say heart. say all your romantic lines by, by then heart. then you'll have her heartstrings in your pockets. Some of our pockets. Step six, we go home for the funnest part. And you know, Woo! Girl, dude, this. this is brilliant. Uh, I don't know how to thank you enough. You're just... You're the man. No. No, no, no. From now on, we are the man. Huh? Uh... He talks, talks like, like a professor, professor, and yet he looks so good. If this guy can't impress her, then I don't think no one could. He's handsome as Adonis. He speaks with grace and charm. So, so if he is two people, what's the harm? <laughs> we're the man, we're the man, we're the man. And we've got ourselves another genius plan. If it's true there's strength in numbers, then our man is strong. And as long as you don't improvise, he can't go wrong. She'll be his biggest fan. Like me and Jackie Chan. What? Oh, it's like a brand new life had just began. Be gone. No, I'm the words guy. You're the pretty face. Stick to that, and we're the man. Here. What is it? A love note. Already? I am. Uh, always keep it with me, just in case. All you have to do is put this letter in her hand And you'll have her like a movie playing on demand There's nothing that's hotter than A smart and handsome man Like me and Jackie Enough Chan Enough with Jackie Chan So it's clear, very clear that we're the man, man. Hello? Hi, Rosanna. It's Calvin. Hi. I spoke to Matt for you. Really? What did he say? He likes you too. I think he'll be asking you out real soon. Oh my god, you're incredible! Uh, like maybe, uh, seventh period and Holly be by the technology room? Thank you! I love you! I love you too. Was that? Hello? Okay. She just had technology, so she'll be coming out that door any second now. Give her the note. Tell her she looks beautiful, and ask her out for Saturday night. What if she's busy Saturday night? If she's busy, invite her to our wrestling meet after school. Nice. She's coming. Dude, beat it before she sees you. You're... 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 Be You're... Be what? My beauta, are you okay? <laughs> My beauty takes your breath away. My beauty takes your breath away. That is so sweet. Okay. I wrote this for you. Want to go outside tonight? Okay, great. Um, yeah, sure. I'd love to. Okay, great. Great. <laughs> great. You want to see my meet? What? My wrestling meet after school today. Um, no thanks. I'm busy. Okay, well, uh, have fun with, uh, whatever you do, do. Okay, thanks for the note. Whatever you do, do? <laughs> whatever you do, do? <laughs> Where'd they go? Kevin Burger, please look through that, please. Special Agent Brett, please stop sneaking up on people. So get this, I just had Mrs. Feingold, and she was running around the room screaming like all this crazy, like, French dialogue. She's like 40 years old, she's nuts, like... Why are you just standing here? When? Right now. You look like a security guard or something. Like. Just, uh, admiring the view. That's a, that's a beautiful water fountain. So are we hanging out Saturday night? I might have something, I'll let you know. What would you have? Something. Shoot, can't be late again. Let me know about Saturday. I will. Call me. How'd the ASCAP go? It went great. You told her she's beautiful? Yeah, sort of. And you gave her the note? Yes, I definitely gave her the note. Good job. We should probably start the lesson. Uh, what class do you have now? Uh, public speaking. Well, let's work on your private speaking. Come in here. The custodians won't care. 
you're going to have to memorize a lot of lines. How's your memory? It's great. When's the last time you tried to memorize something? Um, shoot. Uh, was it? No. Maybe. Was it? You know, I, uh, I, 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 I don't remember. Uh, awesome. Let's do a test. Try saying this. What's in a name that which we call the rose by any other name would smell as sweet? Okay. Uh, what was her name? What's in a name? What's in a name? Okay, sorry. <laughs> Try again. Oh, okay. What was her name? That which we call rose. <laughs> she sure smells sweet. You pick some strange quotes, man. Craig is a dumbass and a smartass. Look, why don't I just try to practice talking normally? You know, like, on the cuff? Off the cuff. But no matter how much I memorize, I'm still going to have to make some stuff up. I mean, think about it. Okay. Tell me I'm beautiful. Uh, you're beautiful. Yes. Go on. More. Um, you're beautiful in every single way. That's good. Go on. Words can't bring you down. What's a song? I knew it. Uh, tell me about my eyes. Your eyes are kind. Kind? Okay. Go on. Um, and your neck. My neck? Your neck is hairy. Pretend I'm her. Sorry. Okay. Uh, your neck is kind. Try saying it's like something. That makes it sound more poetic. Okay. Um, it's like... It's like, um, your neck is like a uh, virgin. I don't know, man. I am dying here. Well, you're doing great. Let's take five. <sighs> okay. But ba bam don't you know me? I'm a suicidal ninja. I'm getting slobby with wasabi and some ginger. Bam, don't you know me? I'm a cripple with a triple nipple. Slam in your head until you're dead. And then it gonna tickle. Bam, don't you know me? I'm a donkey with an afro. What are you doing? Uh, just getting ready for the lesson. Why? Were you just rapping? Yeah, it's this new album I got yesterday. Yesterday? Uh, yeah, it's by this artist named... Glove. I think it's G-Love, that's where the dash is. Never mind. <laughs> Try saying this. Rosanna, your face is a work of art Who's every part I know by heart They say all things in God's design are beautiful And that's just fine But how is it fair that none compare to that masterpiece beneath your hair? That was beautiful, dude Great, but let me hear you. Rosanna, your face is a work of art Whose every part I know by heart They say all things in God's design are beautiful And that's just fine, but how's it fair That none compare to that masterpiece beneath your hair? Word. Holy shit. <laughs> Do it again, nice and easy. Okay, uh... Rosanna, your face is a work of art It's a laughable thought, I know by heart Cause he's dumber than shit, but I have to admit In God's design, that he's got a good shop This is working somehow, and that's just fine Cause he talks like a homie, and look, he is Romeo now To that masterpiece beneath your hair Great, do you think this will work? Of course, cause I'm worried about it, she figures it out She won't, she will think I'm a jerk, and she's probably right Yeah, but if it goes well a hell of a night Never know If you're not such a genius Your face is a work of art Whose every part I know by heart Less gangster, more lover Rosanna, your face is a work of art Close your eyes and then Whose every part I know by heart They say all things in God's design so down, what's the rush? Are beautiful, and that's just fine Get down to a hush But how's it fair that none compare? Bring it louder again To that masterpiece beneath your hair This will drive her insane It will For shizzle and to think that my dad thought my music was bad for the brain You'll never know If I'm not Alfred Einstein Never know If I'm not Mr. Right She will hear pretty words to her side And never know If I ain't so freaking
looking bright. That's the spirit. Now let's go get her. They say all things in God's design are beautiful, and that's just fine, but how's it fair that none compare to that masterpiece beneath your hair? You'll never know I'm your secret admirer, never know it is me that you hear, but did you fall with your eye or your ear? I'll never know till I make my feelings clear. Saturday alone and I can't stop thinking I should be out there having fun Other kids are probably at some party drinking Me, I'm a party of one But I think the popular kids are losers I look like crap in tight jeans I think it's cool to be different Saturday alone with the same old daydream. What if I followed all the trends? If I were a clone and fit in the mainstream, I could be out with some friends. There's only one person I like to be with, and he isn't thinking of me. Calvin, you're on a wild goose chase, can't you see? It's fantasy. Look at me. Look at me. Look and see a girl. A girl who is your friend. Now squeeze those words together. So we can spend a Saturday alone. I mean alone together. That I'd get used to pretty quick Saturday at home snuggled on your sofa watching some new indie flick Hello? Want to come over? Uh, sure. A little late for a movie, isn't it? It's something else. I'll tell you when you come. Okay. I'll see you in a few. That was fast. You smell good. Did you have a date or something? They sprayed it on us at Macy's. Uh, so what's up? I need you, that's what. I'm here. I have the worst writer's block. Never heard it called that before. You see, I never told you what happened that night with Rosanna. Which is fine, because they don't really care. You see, Rosanna told me that she likes the new kid, Matt, and asked me to find out if he likes her. He does, but he's too nervous to talk to her. So I'm writing him love notes to give to her so she'll think he's smart, which he's not. He called and asked for a new note for tomorrow, but I'm totally blocked and I wanted to see if you'd help me. So, you want me to help you help him get her? I guess you could say that. It, why? I, I don't know. He asked me for his help and I want to see where it leads. I cannot believe you're asking me to do this. Please? I cannot believe I'm saying yes. Oh my god, thank you so much. 
Here's what I got so far. Promise not to laugh. Okay, I won't. Friendship is the person who sees you on the outside and knows you on the inside and somehow sees the upside of the things you'd like to hide. And when, and when it, gets it gets intensified, intensified then the love, love and friendship, friendship coincide. And this is why I beam with pride to dream it may come true. The day when I can call myself a more than friend to you. What you reading? Just a note from you know who. I do know who. Hey, you guys use the same stationery. So it's going well? It's going more than well. Why didn't you tell me he was brilliant? <laughs> brilliant? Tell me why you think that. Sometimes when I'm hanging out with him, I look at his face and I think he's in space cause he looks so confused. Looks all perplexed like he doesn't know what to say next. But then he'll say something astonishing. Really? Something so sweet that I knocked off my feet A spontaneous thought that almost sounds planned And I'm in the palm of his hand He seems so simple when we first met But what you see is in what you get He's more than meets the eye He's written me beautiful love notes, a new one each day. Some romantic and sweet, some playful and fun. And I fall in love with each one. Here, let me read you something he wrote. You carry them with you? They're my favorite things in the world. The more you steal from my heart, the more my heart contains. I cherish this kind left. I cherish what remains. You have mine, your heart I must take. That is so beautiful. Thank you for sharing it with me. Mm. Text message. It's from Matt. What? I can't wait to see you again. A G E N N. <laughs> he spelled again wrong. <laughs> Sometimes he makes really cute fake mistakes He'll jumble a phrase or stumble But now I know these are only his ways of being humble He's a deceptive guy He's a lot like Clark Kent Well, you know Cause he's more than meets the I never knew he'd be smarter than you Sorry, it's true He's more than meets the eye More than meets the eye More than meets the eye Rosanna, I thought you just liked the way he looked in wrestling gear No, it's much deeper I wouldn't care if he was the ugliest. Wait, what time is it? 3.15. You were saying? I have to go meet Lindsay. She's hosting the auction. If you've seen that, tell him to write me another note. <laughs> okay. I will. Dude. Hey, man. I've got something really special for you to give Rosanna. Meet me tomorrow morning, and it's yours. Okay, buddy. Thanks. Right. It is time that you knew Who's been writing to you Every word that you read More than meets the eye More than meets the eye 
I know that sounds insane, but I'll try to explain. You should know that although I'm pretending what I feel is as real as can be, and I wish you could like me for me. You should know my inspiration so much more than a beautiful face. You're my special Circumcision fund is yours to keep. With 500 bucks, you can visit your family back in Idaho. Da 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 dum da da dum da dum da dum da. What the hell is this? Guess. You're running for class president? Nope. I'm graduating. It's September. I'm graduating from you, dude. What? You see. The other day, I sent Rosanna a text message without telling you, and it went fine, totally fine. So I've been thinking, why should I still bother you? I can do this alone. It's my father, I like it. Thanks to all you've given me, I'll be fine on my own. I hope thank you well. Dude, I can't thank you enough. Letting go is always tough, but let's still be friends. Matt, doesn't the teacher usually decide when the student is ready to graduate? Uh, I'm ready. We've accomplished everything that we wanted to do. Yes. She's completely into me, and it's all thanks to you. Yes. I've got all the skills I need. Send me off on my way Throw a party 
party and throw confetti Cause it's my graduation day Now, did you ever hear a little bird that left the nest before we started to fly? Uh, nope. All my life I won't forget what a great team we were. Exactly. Are you sure you want to do this? Uh, all the wasting of you when I make out with her. You know what I mean, right? I keep one of those in my wallet. Not that one. You'll be on your own now. You'll have to be strong. And so you're a pro now. Something still could go wrong. Horribly terrible. That's why I must give you this, my final. I don't know what to say. Just say I'll carry with you tonight. I will. Say I'll give it to her the minute you say something stupid. I will. I know you, buddy. And that is why it is a great relief that I officially grant you your graduation. Woo! Hey, 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 it's graduation day now. That's my last disaster. Now I won't know what to say. I just checked Video Palace. Sorry, Pee Wee's in and Tarantino's out. Ah, so Brett, I gotta cancel movie night. Again? I'm, not, I'm way behind on my science project. I'll help you. <laughs> You'd rather watch a movie than do science. No, I don't mind. I'll call you when I finish. Bye. Okay. Right. Now for some science. The effects of my confession on a beautiful girl. Hypothesis. She reads the note and ditches the jock. Procedure. From a window seat in the diner, watch them to exit the bowling alley, and then approach casually. Conclusion? I'm the man. It what? Shy tots. Students helping innocent toddlers off the streets. Did you know that 40,000 babies were born onto the streets last year? That's awful. Isn't it? Where the heck are you supposed to drive? Um, for a fundraiser, I'm organizing a bachelor auction, but it's hard to find guys who will get up on stage. I'd ask you, but you're taken. I might ask Calvin, actually. Calvin? I just saw him earlier today. On a Saturday? Where? Um, at the fishing store. Calvin fishes? No. Uh, he was just, um, getting worms. For what? His science fair project? Yeah! Mm-hmm. <laughs> um, well, here we are. Hey! Nice spare, dude! Good form! Say something poetic. Poetic? Can't we just, like, you know, conversate? You haven't lost your magic touch, have you? No. Um... Standing tall, delicate, and, and frail, like dust in the wind. Until... Yes. 
A big black ball knocks the shit out of him! Yes, dude! Not about bowling, about us! Why are you so silly tonight? Be romantic! Romantic? Okay. Um... I love your beauty. <laughs> I love your booty. Your booty is a beauty. Can you excuse me for a second? Uh, Rosanna, wait. I, I'm sorry. I, I didn't... Crap. Get going, Matt. Yes! No. What do you want? Listen, I said some pretty dumb things and she ran into the bathroom. Perfect. Did you give her the note? The what? If something happens, you give her the note, remember? The note. I forgot. Jesus, Matt. All right, give it to her when she comes back. She, she's coming back. Uh, listen, just give me some lines to get started. We can fix this, you know? Uh, no more lines. Give her the note. Screw the note, man. She's no. by the shoe rental. Are you giving it to her? Are you giving her the note? Dude, just give me some lines or something. I don't know. I just uh, put in your earpiece. Hairpiece? Earpiece. The earpiece. Your cell phone. Earpiece. Right. Okay. Why? Just say exactly what I say. Oh, dude, that's brilliant. Okay. Uh. Okay. 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 Uh, okay. Wait. It's not. It's not going in, dude. Just stay calm. It's, it's not. It's not going in. She's coming back. She's really close. Okay. What? Why did you scream? Why did I scream? Because I was angry. You, I was, you were angry at yourself. Because I, w you, uh, uh, I was angry at yourself. <laughs> For upsetting you with my words. For upsetting you with my words. You did upset me. And when I upset you, I upset and myself when I upset ten times you, more. I upset myself ten times more. I can't be happy when you're sad. I can't be happy when you're sad. Nor sad when Nor you're sad happy. sad when you're happy. Lately you've been Lately giddy and you've exuberant. Been giddy and exuberant. And the fact that, and I, the could fact the that I could be the impetus. <laughs> impetus, you idiot! Impetus, you idiot! Of something so sublime. Of something so sublime. Is enough to make me cry. Is enough to make Honestly me cry. cry. Honestly cry. What the hell, dude? I don't cry for nothing. What? Why did you turn away? Why did I turn away? Because I was overwhelmed. Because I was overwhelmed. Overwhelmed, overwhelmed that a beautiful, that a beautiful, gem, beautiful like you gem like you would go out with a shallow, with a ignorant, shallow, brain dead, cro magnet, phony like me. Brain dead, cro magnet, phony like me. What does that mean? Yeah, what does that mean? I've explained it in a note. Give it to her now. I've explained it in a note. Give it to her now. When do I get the note, Matt? Oh, uh, a Sunday would be perfect. Uh, Sunday would be perfect. Um, oh. Can't you just tell me now? Just hold the nuts, please. Uh, just hold the nuts, please. That's all I want tonight. That's all I want tonight. Oh, do you have a cherry? That'd be great. Do you have a... Ch oh, my God. Okay. Sorry, what, what was I saying? That you're a phony? No, 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 I'm not. It's just... It's just that sometimes words get in the way of things, and... and I don't... I don't know. Can we just use, like, body language tonight? I have to go. Rosanna, wait. I, I have a new note for you. Rosanna! He must have given it to her by now. Cancel that Sunday, please. Behold, did you finally finish? Sorry, Mrs. Rabinowitz. Uh, I'll have my mom call you. Mom, Mrs. Rabinowitz is on the phone.
Hi, Rosanna. Hi. Are, are you okay? Just a confusing night, that's all. What are you doing here? I thought you might want to talk to me. Actually, I do. I'm sure you can guess what it's about. Oh, I think I can guess. And you're interested? What do you think? I was going to ask you, but I didn't think you'd be into it. Into it? I've been dreaming about it for years. Oh, me too. I'm so excited. You know, it isn't just for the babies. It also makes us feel good. Uh-huh. I might do a few of you at once to save time. Depends how many guys we get. Do you mind if we videotape it? Oh. Oh, crap. What? Lindsay got mono. I have to find a new host. Host? For the auction. The auction. Well, thank you for volunteering, Calvin. Uh, here's a bachelor questionnaire. I will need it by Friday, okay? Thank you. <laughs> okay. You're freaking using me? Do what kind of a friend are you? What's going on? Thanks a lot for the note. I read what you wrote. But you had me tricked. I know it looks bad, but listen. Hell of a fight you picked. I can explain. So now you're asking. Stop it. it. Let's discuss this later, Matt. I don't see a reason that Rosanna needs to hear. No, I think that she needs to hear. Hear what? This. One of your notes. I think you mean one of his. Once you do this, Matt, it's done. And I'm not the only one who loses something here. I'm done playing this game anyway. What game? What are you guys talking about? Fine, but not here. Not like this. You tell her, or I tell her. Tell me what? I... I wrote the notes Matt gave you. Why would you do that? Exactly. And? And I made up a lot of the things he said to you. And? Why? So this is your big science project? What are you doing here? Just because you lie to me doesn't mean your mom has to. Oh my god! Calvin, Calvin what kind of friend are you? Exactly. Calvin, look what you did. Calvin, what kind of kid? Write you a phony letter. I, I thought I knew you better. Don't look you in the eyes. Fooling you with fancy lies. Exactly. Friends are people who are trusted. Not you, Calvin. You got busted. What kind of friend? What kind of friend? What kind of friend? What kind of friend? What kind of friend are you? You guys are twisting everything around. Calvin, what kind of friend are you? 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 Name one time you've asked me mine. What does that mean? Calvin, all that we talked about is you, what you feel, who you like. But you know that's not true. That two-faced jerk. It is. I ought to kick his scrawny butt. But Max, guess what? You're not so innocent yourself. You're just a two-faced jerk yourself. Calvin, when will you figure out that I can feel something too? I don't know what you're talking about. Of course I care about your feelings. Just, just forget it. Do you care about my feelings? What? Well, obviously you were the mastermind here. So how did I get to be your lucky victim? Pretty girls are dumb, right? God, I can just imagine you guys high-fiving after every date. I really wasn't like that, Rosanna. Well, then why? Just tell her. It's a long story. Just tell her, I've got time. I, I did it because... Just, Just tell her. her. I did it because... Because... Because you're an asshole. Rosanna, wait! Stay away from her! No! Leave My me nose. alone, both of you! Rosanna, wait! Calvin, are you okay? Go away, you hate me. I, I don't hate you, stupid. Just... Why didn't you tell her? My nose. It still hurts? It's big. Maybe it's swelling. No, it's always been big. That's why I didn't tell her. You're playing with me, right? <laughs> that's, that's what this is all about. All the line, the love notes, your, your freaking nose. People are superficial, Brett. No, what Calvin. You're the superficial one. Build a freaking bridge and get over it.
can I compete with that? She doesn't even have to try. The girl has zero body fat. She strolls all in, grabs the eye of not just Calvin, not just Matt, but every hornball passing by. This deck is stacked, the whole thing's whacked. I might as well accept the fact. I'll never have a face like hers. I'll never face a choice like hers. No boys can meet in for me that I'd like to see. The one she doesn't want, doesn't want me. How can I compete with that? The guy's built like a brontosaurus. Girls pass him in the hall, and hear the hallelujah chorus. Why can't he have a flaw? An extra nibble or a claw? Cause what's the deal? Is he for real? Does anyone feel what I feel? His finger's bigger than my arm. His arm is bigger than my leg. This guy's got muscles where they aren't supposed to be. If I could look like that, would she want me? Just wasn't meant to it just happen. wasn't meant to happen. I've got to look ahead. I've got to walk away. Just when I fall for someone, I fall like for a mind. It's hard that I can't with that. Everybody sees my body, but nobody wants my body. Cause my body is my body. My body is my body. And it just wasn't meant to Shy tots. Yes, that's really the name. Well, they're mispronouncing it. You just say a few jokes, introduce the bachelors, and it's all for charity, so... You have a match that night? I didn't even know we had an origami team. Well, thanks anyway. Special Agent Brett, how are you feeling today? What the hell are you doing? You said I never asked about your feelings. Why aren't you in my bedroom? I wanted to apologize. I'm sorry I lied to you. Can we be friends again, please? I'll always be your friend, Calvin. Oh, thank God. I'm so glad we're back to normal. <laughs> Couldn't take all the tension, you know? Yay, well, uh... Since we're friends again, will you help me with my bachelor questionnaire? <laughs> You're gonna do that? Long story. Yeah, let me see. Why'd you crumble the up? I don't know. It's in a rush. What is your idea of the perfect relationship? Ah, oh, jeez. Uh, like, two best friends, you know, same hobbies, joke around, share secrets. That's enough, right? Should be. Um... What are you looking for in a potential girlfriend? See, these are hard, right? I don't think so. Uh, easy to talk to. Yep. Fun. Yep. Unique. Yep. Pretty. You know what? You don't need my help, mister. It is time that you knew who's been writing to you. What the hell? 
You told her in a note, Cal. Give that to who, me. No, no. Who does that? Finders keepers. Give that to me, Brett. No, 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 no. You told her in a note. Who uh, does that, At Calvin? least I tried to tell her. No, you didn't, you coward. You hid. Yes, I did. No, you didn't. Telling someone is being there face to face, right up in their grill, and just telling them. You think it's so easy? I'd like to see you try it. Fine. Even though I'm not the soul you're aching for Even though we're friends from long ago Even though we've grown as close as people get Let's pretend that we just met Even so That's pretty good Even though I'll never know My imperfection show Even though some days I make a sorry sight See me in a different light Even so Even so this. Uh, thanks for the lesson. Yeah, you're welcome. Okay, take care. <sighs> yes, I know there's only 20 reservations, but I know a lot of kids are coming. They're just being last minute. And if they knew you were hosting. Your sister's bat mitzvah is that night. <sighs> Whatever. Thanks anyways, Christine. Come to the Shittat special auction. Uh, uh, come to the night's big auction. Come support the Shittat. Uh, uh, come to, come to the, come to the... Shit. What are you doing? It's called helping someone out just to be nice. Something you'd know nothing about. They're trying to get her to take you back. I'm doing it so she'll forgive me. Look, man, I'm, I hope it works. I hope she does take you back. You guys belong Dude, together. Dude, don't get all mushy. I'm over it. Can I help you with the flyers? Just to be nice? Sure. By the way, Rosanna might ask you to be in this thing, so just, like, think of an excuse. Thanks, you're a little late. Wait, she got you? Oh my god. Dude, that sucks! <laughs> Tell me. <laughs> well, hey, think of it this way. You're helping those babies off the street before they get run over. Matt, I don't think the babies are getting rich off of Uncle Calvin. Most girls would pay not to have to go on a date with me. What are you talking about? Nerdy kid, big nose. Dude, bigger the nose, bigger the hose. Every girl knows that. Really? Yes. If you had a little style, you'd be a total pimp. That's inspirational. Who do you think is going to give me a makeover in three hours? Step one, we get your clothes. It ain't so baggy. Stupid question. Step two, we comb that hair up off your face. Okay. Step four, that shirt. I'm sorry, dude. It's, well, you look like that guy Jack from Will and Grace. Got it. Step B, we shave your neck and wax your chest hair. Ew, gross! Step nine, we take these glasses off for good. I'll fall off the stage. But when that auction comes, you'll look the best there. And score a girl you never thought you could. Dude, when I'm done with you, you're going to be the most appalling guy at that auction. Oh, I hope you made a feeling. Uh, whatever. Well, maybe I'll get through this. Thanks to your advice. And maybe feeling good about my image will be nice. Cause when it comes to fashion, 
I've always been so dumb And I'm about as brilliant as they come Huh We're the man We're the man And we've got ourselves another genius plan You'll be looking so appalling when this plan is done That the girls will all be calling you to have some fun So here we go again We're two imperfect men One with beauty, one with a mind Working wonders when combined We know we can The pimp can write a poem The queer eye isn't queer it's no wonder we're the man, the man. I didn't think I'd see you here. Hi. Um, a lot of people out there. 600. I don't get it. We only had 20 reservations. And more money. More pressure. <laughs> you came to bid on Calvin, right? Oh, no, no. He likes someone else. Who? Uh, he, he wrote her love notes for the past two weeks. She called him an asshole, which he fully deserved. Oh. You think? Yes, I'm sure. Well, why would he like me anyway? We're so different. So I told him. He's got such a great personality, and yeah, I'm you're just... so plain and boring? Yeah, so I told him. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> you really like him, don't you? I, I like him as long as he's like you. Is that why you're always so nasty to me? Bingo. Well, you'll be happy to know that now I'm the jealous one. Why are you jealous? You know how lucky you are to have something real? You and Calvin are perfect for each other. And that's all anyone's looking for, right? I guess so, yeah. Have you told him? No, but I, I dropped a pretty big hint. You have to bid on him. You're nuts. Why not? <laughs> what if I win and he's not into me? Think how humiliating that would be.
happened? Oh my Jeez. god! Oh my god! Luciana! Luciana! Tell us! Matt, she, she's fine. Chill. Oh my god! Matt, she'll, she'll, she'll get out the vent. Luciana! Matt. Luciana! Can you hear me? I'll figure out eventually. Oh, oh my. There it is. Am I bleeding? No, 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 no. But your nose is a little swollen. You must have bumped it when you fell. I guess I got too nervous about hosting the auction. You know what, Rosanna? I'll host it with you. I want to join Shit Tots. Shy Tots. Shy Tots. When I was hanging with those flyers earlier... You hung up flyers? Thousands. You got 600 people to come. Well, when I was hanging them up, it felt so good to be helping people, so I just kept going. Do you realize that with your work, millions of babies will find a good home, get a good steady job, and put their lives back together. Rosanna, I want to do it with you. I mean, do the work with you. Damn it! Matt, thank you. <laughs> Your bathrooms are a lot nicer than ours. You know, you look like someone I used to know. So you're really going to do this? I owe it to her. You don't owe me anything. I did something awful to you. And it turned out fine. You don't have to do this. I want to go through with it. Plus, I've got 500 bucks to donate, courtesy of Mr. Potato Head. Will you bid on me? Do you really want that? Even though I've been too slow to notice you Even though my confidence is low Even though my nose will never fade from view View it as more me for you Even so There are a lot of girls out there, Calvin Brad, Me and those girls are like night and oranges But you and me were apples and apples, you know? <laughs> Everything I ever wanted was Right in front of my nose. <laughs>
want to thank our director, oh. Emma Ross, oh. music producer oh. and music director and, and choreographer. <laughs> she is so awesome. She put this on at her own house. <laughs> so thank you so much, Emma. I um, love you. I love choreographing <laughs> with you. It was so much fun. I and love you you're so You're one of my much. best friends. Oh my god. I'm so <laughs> glad you did do it. The so wine's not for you, but these are. Yeah. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> Mr. and Mrs. Rath, we got you. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> and flowers. And flowers. <laughs> thank you so much for letting us come to your house and sing and dance and eat. Yeah. And Wherever Mr. Rask is, you're a really good cook. Thank you. Be <laughs> One Three sec. extra wait, more wait. kids. <laughs> um, finally, one big shout out to FedEx, who <laughs> failed to deliver our Mr. Potato Head in time. So uh, this is a football covered in paper. Um, yeah. Thanks a lot for that. Thanks, FedEx. <laughs> Sorry, FedEx, you missed out. But thank you for coming. Yeah, thank, thank you so you much. Thank you so much. <laughs>